Hi and welcome to my studio. It's Lois here from Lois and Morgana Davidson Art and today's studio vlog follows um, another one of my experimentations that I hope you'll find interesting. One of the current themes that I'm exploring is mountains. Mostly what I've been painting is distant mountains so today I wanted to experiment with something that's a little bit more up close, that's a bit more in focus but I wasn't quite sure how to go about it. So I hope you'll enjoy a time lapse watching me experiment with Payne's Grey, Sap Green, Raw Umber, Raw Sienna and Sepia uh, just to see what kind of effects I can get with paint brushes and a palette knife. I start off with my usual pencil sketch and then paint wet in wet and try to create an atmospheric sky that's dramatic but not too overpowering because I want the mountains to dominate. I hope you've been able to see that for this experiment I've worked really freely without too much of a care, just trying and different things and experimenting with colour blends and shapes, soft and hard edges, rich uh, mixes of paint and allowing them to run and blend and then of course scraping through the paint with my palette knife to create texture and highlights and now creating a dry stone wall in the foreground which will be a base for a nice tree just to bring the scene together. So just a few finishing touches um, while I'm still painting wet into wet then I'll leave the painting to dry and see how it looks um, with a winter bare branched tree growing out from behind the stone wall.
So I've painted my tree using my number two Pro Art Rigger brush and a mixture of Payne's Grey with the sepia as well. Just trying to build up a nice tangle of bare branches that comes across and complements the mountains rather than distracts from them. I think the colour and strength of the darks in parts of the trunks and branches of the tree and of course in the dry stone wall complements the closest mountain on the left and balances out the values here. I mean this is just an exploration, it's just a sketch in order to become a finished painting it would need a lot more refinement I think but I've really enjoyed the process it was very exciting to paint to paint so freely and without too much sort of um, attempt at trying to capture detail or trying to sort of paint in a particular way I just decided to use whichever tools I wanted and really enjoyed myself just freely moving from one thing to the other just to create this dramatic scene and I hope you'll um, be inspired to maybe have a go at some ex similar experiments yourself where you sort of take the pressure off yourself and just give yourself the chance to play with paint, brushes and your tools and you never know what you're going to turn up with. I'm really happy with this because this painting, although it's not particularly refined, it captures some drama and some atmosphere, which is what I was looking for. Well, I hope you enjoyed seeing me try to sort of really loosen up in the studio and just sort of express the drama of the mountains um, in paint onto the paper. And if you enjoyed it, then uh, please give the video a thumbs up and maybe subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. It's free to do and it really helps with our reach here on YouTube. And many thanks again to everybody on Patreon that supports this channel. We couldn't run it without you and we really do appreciate each and every one of you. And I'll see you again soon. Take care and happy painting. Bye.